Greetings and salutations and welcome back to our Let's Play of EU4 with Red Bastard as Brittany. We last left our nation, we were just opportunistically sniping off various nations on our way over to Bhutan. We're going to do that right now. We've given them enough of a reprieve. Lu Wu and Tidor. Yeah, we'll just bring our forces over and that'll be our next war. Okay. Portugal's turned all right. Okay, let's get her as a 5230 general. Sure. And they would accept this peace deal, giving us the fort here, giving us Cuba, giving us Peru. And we're not taking these. Maybe we could. If we hold out for a little bit. No, they have a fort there. Yeah, well, if we can't take them both, why bother taking either of them in this war? This is... This is good. I can't, I can't complain about picking up those three from them. We're just going to get the plus three guy. And we're going to send our army back up to our capital. Let's split it off in half and send this army up here and just taking a kind of roundabout way. And Brittany, or Burgundy, I keep saying that. Burgundy is attacking Netherlands. I don't like that at all. I think it's because they are protecting Cologne. Okay, we are at peace, so we could decide upon who our new rivals are going to be. And Spain is the only valid option. But we have a royal marriage with them. We have the same dynasty. I would like a personal union if we can get one. And Bohemia doesn't have an heir. They're 61 years old. We could get a, to trust Amara on the throne. Let's improve relations there. We could actually just seize the, or claim their throne if we wanted to force a union. I wouldn't be surprised if we just get a personal union of them. Okay, our subjects are all very loyal. And we'll just wait a few months before doing anything crazy. Let's improve relations here. And that was this one. Let's try to close this off with Scottish, who we will be attacking soon. Where are their allies? Just Burgundy. Well, if we were to attack you right now, Burgundy would not protect you. I can't think of a better thing to be doing with our time. So we have a spare general here. Let's just move over to Lothian. They gave us a big ship. We'll separate that out. Should we? Yeah, it slows down our ships. They can just go into our capital. Check trade in the English Channel. And go home when you're damaged to gold. We're not going to call on our allies. We shouldn't need to. And we shouldn't need all of these troops on their fort. It's just got a hundred. Ooh, uh, what do we want here? We want the military benefits, although we should have gone for the other one to get extra admin. Okay, these guys and several. 
of our infantry should capture this. Our subjects will take this over. Actually, we can send this army south. Mexico should... Sedgwick should take over Scottish Mexico. And... Oof. Separatists there. Well... That was the army of Ausa that we, so we annexed Ausa up here, and their army had moved south, so they became separatists. Try to deal with them, and then try to kill off these Scottish with their three-star general, 6331 Ruthless General. That guy's pretty cool. Hey, but we also have a fleet and army over here. If we attack them, they'll bring in Lu Wu and Tidor. Lu Wu wouldn't bring anyone new to the party. Ottomans are colonizing over here. Okay, Tidor is over here. And they wouldn't bring in anyone new to the party. So let's go ahead and declare this war. Bhutan is the war leader. Both of them is co belligerents, and we want imperialism. You go there, and you with your three siege, and go down here. Let's keep an eye on what's going on here. They got a 5-5-2 general as well. We'll leave our fleet in place until we've captured Bhutan's capital. And micromanaging this to get all of them over as quickly as possible because of the Scottish troops. They could wipe out little isolated stacks, which wouldn't be good for us. Spell the drop. Get a real marriage there. Real marriage there. And we lost some legitimacy, so let's get that up a little bit higher. And we won't worry about trying to seize any of those or anything crazy. Okay, where are you guys? Get you back home. We need a royal marriage with Bohemia. They got an heir. And now there's a Holland and a Gelra. Netherlands got wrecked. But they didn't have to give up the alliance with us. Let's move up here. that province and let's deal with these rebels our fleet is not yet in place now it is yeah we'll put a ring on it well they proposed so romantic so romantic okay we're 10 minutes into this video so we're doing up here I'm half tempted to just attack some of these people before they get any allies. Would the Emperor protect them? The Emperor would. And who are their allies? Aachen, Brandenburg, Cleves. So we wouldn't have to worry about them.
Let's just get our troops into position. Okay, do you have a general? We find you a general. You. Uh, not really. Okay. What did you ally Trier? That's fine by us. The Emperor will be coming in. Uh, we don't have to fear him, I don't think. And do troop counts. I'm not in the business of fearing our enemies this run. Okay, we took those rebels out. So let's get these guys down here. They'll pick up more men along the way. Looks like they lost their general. Our subject will have to deal with that. We don't have any troops in the region. Okay, we did land and we've almost got their capital. Killed Aachen's troops. And I do see some Brandenburgers coming down here. We don't have a general. We have a spare general that we're not using somewhere. This guy. And bonus props to you if you can pronounce that gentleman's name. Assume it's a gentleman. Let's get this fleet over here for a naval blockade. We should upgrade them after this. Okay, they stopped to deal with those provinces, which works for us. And lots of uprisings in our Peruvian region. Captured Aberdeen Shire. Okay, Luwu, we're going to annex you, take all of your cash. Bust your fort. Core you. And add you to a trade company. Okay, we conquered some territory up here, so let's keep moving. I'm just trying to keep an eye on what's going on all over the globe. These guys are marching south to help out in South America. And I think we could probably sign this peace deal. That's what we want. They're colonies. I pick those up this we want we have that if it's Scotland itself we're just taking all of your colonies that we can find and we're probably picking up more colonies than we have room for okay is there anything else that you guys have outside of Scotland. I mean, I guess we could take some Scottish territory. Not really overextended at the moment. Not much, anyway. Let's take that. We have some claims on our subjects. We take more of Scotland. Let's take these islands. Those islands. Okay, that's that's a peace deal. 
of the month. A few days. Move these guys south. We'll destroy this fort. Definitely don't want to have to deal with that. Okay, these ones we definitely have to core. Those ones we have to core. Yeah, I think all of this we do have to core. Let's see if that gave us any really high. Is there unrest? Yeah. Those are islands, those are islands. That's an island, that's in West Africa. These ones we can add into trade companies. I think we'll be okay. We can get rid of these guys, we don't need them. Keep an eye on all this coast. It's all added. They should state this. And our clarity needs something. We could give them this, but it's not stated yet. It's not a full cord. Okay, this we could add in. Just try to do all of this at once. Let's make sure that, yeah, we're not converting anything that we had just closed off to us. We're um, adding it to trade companies. Okay, we do want to get some troops onto the continent if possible. I don't see how that's going to be very likely. Okay, clergy wants more land. Let's give them those. Let's see if we can do any more interactions. We get to get some cash. And let's see how long this video has been going on. 18 minutes, okay. They are. Colonial stuff is looking pretty good. Do we have some colonies in progress? We're going to split this army up and send half there and half there. And hope. Uh, looks like our colonial subjects are. Uh, maybe we should build some marks down here. Yeah, we'll just kill all the rebels and then get rid of those mercs. 61. They should be okay. Yeah, taking all this, all this stuff. Let's keep an eye on what's going on in Europe. I have been watching the red dots to make sure that we're not under attack. Okay, Holland has fallen to us. That's good news. And we'll just wait for all of these guys to finish off recruiting. Royal marriage with Netherlands ended. Could we vassalize you? No, you have your own subjects. Colonies. Oof, 40,000 troops. We do want to bring these guys together. At 24,000. Could we leave just two guys behind and hit them here now? Okay, we'll um, worry about that in a second. 
So we're going to prioritize Fiji because it gives us overextension. Capture this. Let's see if Tidor is ready for peace. None of this stuff is giving us overextension because it's all stuff they colonized. Do they have anything else that they colonized? No. So let's take that. And some cash. Plus that fort. And we're just going to add everything into our trade company. I think this is all in the Malukas region. Let's check Malacca. Check the Philippines. Okay, we're good in that regard. And we'll start coring some stuff. 71. Okay. Let's take them out only upset these people we just beat up on, so we're okay. Add that in. Okay, Brunei would be nice to beat up on soon. Move over here. We could call other people in. I want to call you into our war. Burgundy, make yourself useful. Oh, I don't want to call too many great powers in. Any of these great powers. Naval race. Let's reduce our overextension because we're going to do that eventually anyway. And the papacy, sure. Make yourself useful. I was still waiting on one more unit of mercs in each of these. Aren't we? Just, just here. Can we get four? Okay, all of you guys merge up here. Avengers assemble. Our mountains, so I'm not super excited about attacking them into the mountains. We'll wait till they move up here, I think. In the meantime, we're going to go south. Actually, let's deal with this stack. Do we have any free generals? We do. Good. Okay, right, place your bets. Trier or Brittany? No. No. Sometimes it's underwhelming. Okay, we control so many trade nodes. You know what? Let's get these guys back to London and get them repaired or upgraded. See, are we going to be able to upgrade them again? We will next level, but that's going to take some time. Let's just get them upgraded. Because we're ahead of time on that tech. And let's make sure that, yeah, any damage. Uh, just check things over, make sure we're doing all right and everything. Do we have royal marriages with all of our allies, for instance? We do, we do. Not with Spain. So let's get that royal marriage as soon as we have a guy back. Okay, they surrendered. Let's get over here. And those Dutch troops won't be very effective. But 
vassalize them. We're just going to isolate them and take their cash. If they're smart, they'll pull this army up. And the battle will take place this month. So let's shift consolidate to get our troops as effective as possible. Ah, they're fighting pretty effectively. Avoided that stack wipe. And let's march down there. So we really didn't need our allies to be called in. But, you know, we've got favors. Okay, let's ask Bohemia for administrative. They'll give us some monarch points if everything pans out. Where are you guys going? We will hit them here, so. Liars. Molly, no, I don't think that's going to happen. Zimbabwe, sure. Thank you for the 25. We're not done yet. Okay, who do we need to beat up on next? Trier. Bohemia, man. Do you have a debt? Take on your debt. Build up your forts. Sure, we'll send him money. We've got an overabundance. No, Morocco, he may not have military access. I know what you're up to, but I don't like it. Whatever it is. You know what you're doing, and you know you should stop. Okay, 27 minutes in. We'll, we'll let this run for a few more minutes for an no vow, we can maybe knock Trier out in that time. And the other thing we need to do is make use of these troops. So, you've got some allies. You've got some allies. Let's fall through with this threat. They went Venod. They've got a lot of cash, at least they did. VJ might try to protect them, in which case we'll beat up on VJ. Hey, Bohemia, just stay in the war despite having your stuff. Things sieged out. Nice. Because we'll reward you with some territory. Okay, we could potentially give that to Burgundy if they want it. Take a look, you're not interested. Okay, so let's move over here and try to help liberate Rog. Alliance. No, it's just military access. Alliance. Alliance. And who else? Brandenburg. Oh, we could take out Cleves first. And it looks like people are retreating there, so that's a great place to attack. Come with kindness. Three hugs. It's my hugs, guys. Okay, let's keep coring. Trips should be in place over here. They are. BJ will not protect them. Which is smart of them.
and we will thank VJ for that. By giving them the opportunity to be part of a larger empire. And just dump an obscene number of troops on top of that. Gain some more development for our subjects, and let's keep an eye on what's going on down here. Okay, they did move on to this fort, so we will attack them. And sadly, they're going to probably take it before our troops get there. They're starting to pay for those forts. I don't like that, so... Maywar. Do we care about Maywar? They're pretty big. Let's not try calling them in as co-belligerents or anything. We don't need anything out of you, I don't believe. So let's just try to piece you out. Take your cash. Give up claims in the Dutch region. You have to end that alliance, that alliance, that alliance. That alliance, definitely. That one. Wow, you've got a lot of allies. Or had, I should say. Let's get over there. Because they liberated a province, we can't have that. Let's get these guys in the port for a month. Have a nod. Take you over if we have room for 31. We do. Let's take your cash, and it won't even upset me. Uh, should we increase the autonomy here? I think we're going to. We could just build more buildings to bring it back down. Remind me that we have things to do with our money. Bring down that autonomy. We're going to do the same here, 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 and here. I'm planning on doing it there as well. We don't have much manpower. Let's spend our money. Okay, that's going to produce a lot of manpower for us. Let's see about here. Not really. Okay, we are ahead of time on military tech. So let's raise some more taxes. We're chaining these wars together. And we have too many colonies at the moment, so that's a drain on our economy. But otherwise, we're doing just fine financially. Let's get this ship upgrading to a three-decker. And we put down those rebels. Let's get rid of this force. And they'll help our economy out because that was putting us over our, our limit. How are we doing on colonists? Oh, I need to move that foot. Sorry. Sorry, bud. Talking to Cat, obviously. Um, we could abandon this because we can't effectively protect it, as we're seeing. But let's see how badly damaged it gets. Somebody else will just snatch it up if we abandon it. Okay, why don't we move all these guys together here? Let's 
got a 50% chance of falling. Bring down the war exhaustion. Let's check in all of our subjects. They're all pretty loyal. Any debt? We've got some debt. Have too much debt. Okay, so we'll save up a little bit of money to pay off this. 234. I think that was the only one. Yeah, we need two, 234 more. Okay, Flemish Separatists. I don't see any reason to let them succeed while our ally is actually helping us out. Finish our colony. Let's abandon it. It's too badly beat up. Okay, Havana. We'll help out with that. Was it you who had the debt? Yeah. Okay, that's all we have money for at the moment. Split this army in half. In half up there. Split it further. No, Bohemia. This is a white piece. They didn't lose anything. If I wanted to give them things, do you guys have any cores you don't currently control? No, you don't. Okay, um, we can't pay off your debt yet. Declined. Okay, Lithuania, Brandenburg. So we'll gun for this fort. Heck, does no penalty really matter? Pull these guys back to here. Orange hollow. Okay, well that's fine. We don't necessarily want to deal with all of these colonies anyway. Now it's much more affordable. It's only costing us 18 ducats. We're making money rather than losing it. Seek support of the clergy. And let's re let's do this. I'm up to 61. And we get 100 points from them. Gets us some more coring. Nobility wants that province. It's little islands in the North Sea. Let's let him have it. Kinji. So we'll attack him here. And there. And these, these guys are going to cross. That's why I'd separated them. Wow, they are not holding up very well. So do we have a spare general? We do, and he's got siege. Let's split this army in half though, because we're experiencing some low manpower issues. Let's keep an eye on the Caribbean. They went more, more troops there, more mercs. But let's see if uh, Bohemia is in debt. 
they have no debt. Okay, good. Let's see how long this video's been going on. 39 minutes. Let's stop here.